guys if you see if you saw the previous video that i uploaded last week you saw how this one got so feisty so people nowadays assume that people in high school should not fall in love like guys are falling in love and people are not talking about this openly like you us we have an open connection an open relationship with our mom so we like tell her everything no types of moms parents guardians the overprotective ones, the ones who won't let you go anywhere, won't give you a phone, won't do anything for you. They just need you to stay in the house, church house, church house. There was church house, church house books. Church house, church house books. <laughs> and then there are those who will give you the freedom, give you a phone, let you do anything you want. After all, they've given you everything. It's your life. And then there's our mom. Our mom is this type of person who will take care of you, is strict, and will give you any advice you need on love and boyfriends and everything. So we are kind of open with our mom. Personally, what I've learned so far in love that you should not enter a relationship expecting anything from anyone. Because expectation, your expectations won't match up to the to the guy you you're dating because no one's perfect. Like seriously, you go there wanting a prince charming, <laughs> you'll get something very very. <laughs> Very different experience, right? I know, right? <laughs> so, what when you first entered, when you first like fell in love with someone, you started dating them. Mm. What was that like for you? I was like, okay, I was waiting for someone who will be like, uh, that nanny, that prince from Cinderella. <laughs> I thought he would be nice, he would take note for many dates. <laughs> Sorry to say so, but it's true. The one who will be so like so caring you won't play me you won't see me like the trap queen any two right like i'm the only person i'm the most important but it went exactly opposite he didn't totally. on dead. Hey, no 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 okay. but in what ways he didn't care for you didn't yeah he didn't even yeah yeah he did personally the first ad- disadvantage that i usually have most of the girls that are date girls not, yeah boys or guys or what they are so bad. They they just wait for me to look for them. Communication is key, number one, when you enter a relationship. Mm-hmm. Obviously, we all know that. So, what is it like in high school? What do you hear guys saying that, mm-hmm. okay, when they fell in love, they expected... Mm-hmm. Like, what is the experience generally in high school mm-hmm. between you and your friends and how you relate and how you talk about love? Are, they, are there ones, the ones who say they want anything as long as they're falling in love or the ones who want everything and they, they won't just give their love to anyone? Most of my friends tend to like more, a guy who, like, who has a lot, who has a lot of money. Yeah, most of my friends. Generation this. <laughs> if you don't have money, then you can walk away. Most of my, I swear like 99% of my friends like money. They like, like, like the person usually takes them for movies or something, takes them for a photo shoot, they like couple goals. Do you think guys nowadays are stereotypes? Like they're moving to one rhythm, like especially you guys in mm-hmm. high school. Are you moving in the same rhythm like my friends? Is it the person who you like? Is it really influenced by the type of people you're around because they're saying they want this and you, you you're like you feel like you also want that mm-hmm. when they say they want a guy who will take them out take them on photo shoots go on dates every day buy pizza tell them to take it home to their family know, stuff right? like that what <laughs> is that what you expect also yeah. do you think the people you surround yourself with influence the type of person you want to date yeah because i most my personality i usually talk about someone who i like most I, t- I tell them, I tell it to my friends. I tell them, oh my God, I have that. I have a boyfriend. So the name is so and so. He's like this. Then my my friends tend to tell me, Nambona mm, out. That's why don't you go for shoots? Why don't you post pictures together? Why doesn't he post you? Why doesn't he talk? It's to a social you? media. Yeah, I know. Okay, you guys call anyone who has money. Money. Someone who takes you out on dates, on mm-hmm. photo shoots. Mm-hmm and everything someone so you tend to call him a sponsor yeah it doesn't matter his age or does it most most of age? my friends don't date like they don't date they don't date people who are so older than them so let me ask you would you date an older guy no uh, like two years older than me or one actually i can never date a, you know you see jay kwana crush a deal with any trainer in school 
or teacher and my friends the other friends of mine who tend to like like wababa you know the girl tends to tell me why are you dating a form four boy like you hey that's not good you know when you you are, you are dating a form four you are more mature than him so may i tend to say imagine a partner because when he's in school i'm also in school yeah. if i date you you're in campus i'm in school you'll be playing me even out of experience my friends my friends who are boys tell me that you can never stay without a girl even for a week do you think you fall more in love with the things like taking me out on dates mm. taking pictures with me more than the person himself like he might he might not even be so into you but the fact that he takes you out on dates mm. he takes photos with you posts you on instagram and other social medias mm. will that keep you do you mean that will stabilize the relationship more than when you're in love mm. and in secret i don't like secret relationships because if it's secret it's so hard for you to know the person he's dating and it's so hard for you it's so easy for him to cheat on you you know why mm -hmm. if you post your girlfriend on, on social media or put her well, on your status or your gp yeah people tend to be like ah hadi siwezi mtaka kwa sababu akona nani seme let's say like sizi mtaka kuzi akona morin or something or akona keren or something no if if he doesn't post you there's something he's hiding definitely oh, sure because out of experience if he's not posting me if he, he, he even he like the the reactions even the way he's texting me it's like He's but what if he's favor. loving you he loves you kabisa like let him show it to me you. he'll show you but he won't post you he won't take you out on dates you can just hang out no i don't like such relationships i want you to show me out to the world to see that i'm your girlfriend or something that's so that's you'd rather me. stay in a relationship where he shows you off but doesn't even love you that much uh -huh. he only likes you instead of a relationship that is secret and i don't know why I like I just don't like private relationships. You know why? It's but so hard for you think uh, the more you're posting your guy and all the stuff you he does for you, mm. the more other girls want him so that they, he does that stuff for them. True, true. But personally, I don't like Adika who don't post me. Post me once or twice in a in a while cuz if you, you don't post me totally it shows like there's something that you're hiding depends on the guy's personality i say mm. no mm. So, i'm attacking by the way maybe he doesn't uh, want other boys yeah to fall for you maybe you are beautiful they don't want you to <laughs> <laughs> i really hardly doubt that <laughs> i know <laughs> sorry guys for the light change you're using the light from the from the windows and the sun has just gone down guys that's why there's a lot of light changing our video guys what do you think the kind of person you date mostly influenced by the people you surround yourselves with is it influenced by social media if he posts you and takes you out if he has money so you wouldn't date a person who lives in chandutu <laughs> okay it's true that's me the person but you can help with you grow <laughs> no how will i help him and i'm also living in my parents house how what what basis do you categorize the guys or girls you want to date leave a comment remember to like share subscribe and comment on this video miss more comment and yeah, comment <laughs> remember to like share subscribe <laughs> okay guys that's it for this video <laughs> remember to like share comment and subscribe if you're new We'll see you next time. My sister is going back to school. I'll miss her so much. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs>